people were gathered around this big hole and it was super strange because you were like, what is going on? Something's wrong on the beach. I think somebody fell in. And they're saying right now there's a little girl buried in the sand. Okay. What was happening at a Florida okay. beach called Lauderdale by the Sea on Tuesday was horrific. Nine-year-old Maddox and seven-year-old Sloan Mattingly, both from Fort Wayne, were playing when they got trapped underneath the sand. Okay. Yeah, they, they need help. They okay. really do. Okay. No. I don't know. I'm standing back. My husband's up here and a bunch of men are digging on the beach. Thomas Rosses was the there okay. seeing the tragedy unfold. There were people screaming, does anyone have any buckets? Does anyone have surfboards? Because they needed help getting the sand out of the hole and also keeping the walls uh, strong enough so the sand didn't cave back in. Emergency crews responded around 3 p.m. Maddox was the first child pulled out. We're told the nine-year-old boy is in stable condition and is expected to survive. There is a little girl buried under the sand and they have not gotten to her yet. 15 minutes had passed and they were still trying to figure out where this little girl was located in the sand. Sadly, it was too late. Seven-year-old Sloan Mattingly was pronounced dead at the hospital. They tried. Um, digging her out, but the more they dug, dug, the more the sand collapsed. The little girl attended Lafayette Meadows Elementary School. This letter was sent to families Wednesday. In the letter, Principal Jenny Fidel described Sloan as a bright, sweet, and loving first grade student.